today I'm going to show you how to connect to VK3 Lit's BBS. Before we get started, we need to know a little bit about what we are connecting to. Specifically, we need to know the call sign, the SID, the frequency, and the modem type. Today we'll be connecting to VK3 LIT-1 on 144.875 MHz using FM and a 1200 board modem. For our configuration, we'll need to make sure the radio is configured for data mode and check the swear is good. The main tools I'll be using for my setup is Direwolf, AX25 tools and AX25 apps. There's many ways of connecting to a BBS, so you might find yourself using a hardware TNC, a different modem or different software. All the software we need is already packaged on Debian Raspbian, so all we need to do is app get install Direwolf, AX25 tools, and AX25 apps. We'll be using Direwolf, which acts as a software sound modem, and we'll control an ICOM 7100, in this case via USB. The next thing we'll do is configure AX25 ports. This involves setting a port number, our core sign, the speed of our modem, the packet length that we're going after, a window size, and a description. For Direwolf, I've created a very basic configuration file that basically lists a sound card, my call sign, the modem speed, the rig control settings. I also have some configuration options that are specific for my setup. When we start Direwolf, we'll be using three arguments. Dash C defines the configuration file. Dash T will disable terminal colors. And Dash P will enable the virtual KISS TNC, which we'll be using just in a second. So we'll need to note down the KISS TNC path. That's that slash dev slash PTS slash three. And in another window, we'll use that to We'll do kiss attach dev pts31, and one is the port number that we defined in the AX ports. We also need to run kiss params dash c1 dash p. The dash c1 configures the CRC type to be what Direwolf is expecting and the dash P1 is our AX25 port. There's two simple tools to do AX25 calls on Linux. One is called AX25 underscore call, and the other one is called call. There's some slight differences between them, mainly that AX25 call is designed to connect to uh, Linux programs using sort of your normal uh, line breaks while the core command connects specifically to BBSs that use the legacy line break style. Since VK3 LIT1 uses the modern line break style, we'll use the AX25 call app, and its arguments are the AX25 port number that we defined in our configuration file, followed by your call, and then the station you're calling. So in this case, it's VK3 FUR, calling VK3 LIT-1. The AX25 call command is now talking to the Linux kernel to communicate via AX25, and the Linux kernel is then talking to Direwolf through that virtual KISS interface. Direwolf is then acting as a software modem, converting that into sound and sending that over the radio and it should be triggering your radio to do that communication back and forth. So we should get connected, and we'll be able to browse the BBS, uh, look at mail, look at the board, do whatever. Every BBS is different, so I'm not going to give instructions on how to use a specific one. But you can see me here using VK3 Lits to look at a few messages. That pretty much wraps it up. Hopefully you've learned a enough about BBSs uh, Direwolf and the AX25 core commands to be able to connect into a BBS. If you have any questions, chuck them down in the comments and I'll try and get back to you. That's all I have for the moment. Give it a go and have fun.